Sometimes instead of counting all characters within a cell, you may need to count only the occurrences of a specific character, number or special symbol. You can use a formula based on the substitute and len functions. To count a single character, for example b in a2, use this formula. Instead of specifying the character you want to count in the formula, you can type it in a cell and then reference that cell in a formula. This formula works by using substitute to first remove all the characters being counted in the A2 by replacing it with an empty string. Then the length of the text with the character removed is subtracted from the length of the original text. The result is the number of B's that were removed which is equal to the count B's in A2. Substitute is a case sensitive function and so is the formula. A2 contains 7 B's, 2 uppercase and 5 lowercase. The formula has counted only the uppercase characters because we supplied uppercase B to the substitute function. If you need count of character irrespective of case, embed the upper or lower function inside substitute before running the substitution. Make sure to use the same case character as the text that's being substituted. You can also use nested substitute functions. Use the formula. First remove uppercase B using substitute and embed that inside another substitute which removes lowercase b's. If you want to count many characters but not want to modify the formula each time, type the character you want to count in a cell. Then convert that cell's value to uppercase and lowercase by using the upper and lower functions. For example, enter the character you want to count in B7. Use this formula. You can also convert both the source cell and the cell containing the character either to uppercase or lowercase. Use this formula. Regardless of whether the uppercase or lowercase character is input in the referenced cell, this formula will return the right count. Let us see how to create a table of different character counts in a text. Enter the text in A2. Enter the characters to count in column A starting at A4. First let us use nested substitute method. Enter this formula in B4. Use absolute reference for cell A2. Now copy the formula down using the fill handle. you will get the character count in column B. Alternatively, you can use the formula or you can also use this formula copy the formula down using the fill handle. You have a table of character counts. To count the number of times a character occurred in a range, use any one of the formulas used to count a character in a cell and the sum or sum product function. For example, to count the number of times O appeared in the range A2 colon A5, use this formula. The sum first calculates the character count in each cell and then sums them to give a total character count in the range. You can use sum product instead of sum. It works the same way as sum when you have a single range. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.